Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome to another episode of The Snack Break. This is Monique, aka The Eatin' This Bitch. Uh, today, we're gonna do some mildly Thanksgiving holiday season related shenanigans. We've got the Trader Joe's Pumpkin Sticky Toffee Cakes. This is their riff on the traditional kind of like English dessert sticky toffee pudding. Uh, they come in these like little cute little blunt shapes. Um, you just heat them up in the oven. And I think you could actually heat them up in the microwave too, but um, I don't think I would do that. I usually would just prefer to heat this up in the oven, which I have. Uh, two of these come to a box and this one just came out of the oven a little while ago. So it's still pretty warm. You can see that it's got like this little frosting stuff on top, like a little glaze, and it looks like almost like a donut. Yeah, looks really, really soft. It smells delicious, actually. <laughs> really, really like kind of spicy. Um, not just pumpkin spice, but like aggressively spicy. Um, not in terms of heat, but in terms of like the cinnamon, the clove, the nutmeg. But yeah, I, I smell that and it instantly smells like fall. Um, I, look, I know a lot of y'all very much over the pumpkin spice thing. I get it. I understand. I don't want pumpkin spice bagels and bullshit either, right? But as a person who genuinely does love pumpkin and love squash, um, and I love sticky toffee pudding too, um, this is kind of like right up my alley in terms of like, ooh, this would be a delicious, delicious dessert. Um, I do kind of wish that I had some plain vanilla ice cream or, um, some whipped cream because I feel like that would be great with this um but that's okay that's okay if I love it and I recommend it just make sure that you pick some up you know when you're going the next time you go to Trader Joe's <sighs> all right oh man this smells so good let's take a nice oh spoon goes right in there very soft Let's take a look at the inside. Let's see, let's see if we can just open this up. Really, really moist looking cake. It looks really tender. All right, and let's take a bite. Mmm, oh my God. That is like embarrassingly good. Mm. The cake is so soft. Wow. That's really, that's absolutely fucking delicious. Um, and light, a lot lighter than I was expecting this to be. Even though it's very intensely flavored, the crumb of the cake is really soft and light. It sort of melts in your mouth as you're eating it. Yeah, you definitely, some ice cream or some barely sweetened whipped cream would be fantastic with this. Yeah, I wouldn't even want like, if, I mean, obviously, if you got like the can of whipped cream, that's fine. But if you have a chance, if you have some time, just some plain, heavy cream, whip that shit up, shake it in a jar, whip it with your hand or with like a hand mixer or anything and um don't sweeten it maybe just the tiniest bit of sugar the tiniest bit of maple syrup or something but yeah that would just oh this is this is very good <laughs> this is very very good mmm mmm and then the edges of it gets all crispy and like caramelized so you've got the crispy caramelization of the edges and then you've got like a little frosting crap on the top mm. Okay, Trader Joe's. Yeah, I would definitely recommend this. Highly, highly, just go out and get it. I don't know much how I know how much longer they'll have it, probably until Thanksgiving. But um, you should pick up a couple of these. Like I said, it only comes two to a box. So if you're having like four to six people over, obviously, you know, get a few more. I'm not sharing. So anyone who's like, I just want a half. I just want a half. Fuck halves, okay? Just eat the whole damn thing. Just eat it, please. Okay. One... Can I have a bite? Yes, you may have a bite. 
I'll share with you, just not with other people. Hold on. Hang After. On. You sure? No, 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 try it, try it, try it. What do you think? Yeah, okay. The cameraman saying okay. He's giving his thumbs up to this. Uh, yeah, no, definitely go out and get these. These are delicious. It only takes about 15 minutes to heat up. Also, yes, let's go back to my little rant that I was about to go on. I understand not everyone eats the way they used to, right? No one's eating a bunch of stuff anymore. You go to Friendsgiving, you go to uh, your Christmas dinner, your whatever dinner. Everyone brings a lot of stuff or a lot of food gets cooked. No one eats all of it. I understand. But when it comes to dessert, just eat the whole slice of pie. Eat the whole cookie. Eat the whole slice of cake. The world is garbage. Take joy whenever you can and just eat the whole dessert. I swear you'll feel better. And even if you have a tummy ache, there's Pepto-Bismol for that. Just, just eat the whole thing, all right? I guarantee you, it will probably make you feel better. And if not, I mean, that's all I got, okay? <laughs> so thank you so much for joining me for today's episode of The Snack Break. Like I said, go out and get these sticky toffee cakes. They're really, really delicious. Uh, and we'll see you next time for another episode.